Go. In what's being dubbed a world first, a Bathurst farmer is sowing crops with the power of the sun. Today, the concept caught the eye of Australia's leading conservationist. So this is probably the world first demonstration of zero emission sowing. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. With that bold statement, Michael Inwood was behind the wheel and away to a gentle hum. No petrol, no gas. This ute is powered by the sun. These 45 computer encrypted batteries are energised by solar panels on the garage and store enough energy to pull a combine. 200 horsepower, 150 kilowatts. It has 500 newton metres of torque. To beat any scepticism about solar energy's place on farm, locals were given the chance to go over the vehicle with a fine tooth comb. Certainly a talking point considering it's cost about $40,000 to pull off. But it was thumbs up all round, including from one of Australia's leading environmentalists. It's one of those things where someone has done something that everyone talks about and thinks about, but here's a farmer near Bathurst who's actually done it. Basically anyone else today could look at it and say, um, gee, we'd like to look at that and, and do similar things and get results within two to three years. One of the most fascinating things about what Michael is doing is that combined with no kill sowing, that's no chemicals, no fertilisers, very minimal impact on the ground, his ute doesn't use any fossil fuels and he's planted trees on his place. He says this whole project isn't just carbon neutral, it's actually contributing to the environment. A zero carbon in inputs to uh, grow crops within grasslands and uh, maintaining all the full biodiversity and natural function. That's why I believe it's arguably the most environmentally friendly vehicle in the world. And today there was no argument. People on the land can make a very, very positive contribution to this issue of combating climate change. Hugh Whitfeld near Bathurst, Prime News.